Give him money, count mad door. Young nigga gon' live it up. Out of all A, hella ice. You just got don't spend it up. I'm bring my team with me. Make sure that I split it up. Japanese niggas with Brazilian. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Breezy back at you with another video, man. Today I got a special one for you. But first, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the uh, bell. But let's get right into it. Brand new build, slash and play. I'm playing with my boy Zeke. He's a stretch four. He has no badges. I have some of my badges. I think I think I have all my finishing and the playmaking ones. Maybe the defensive too. We'll see. But I have no shooting badges. This build is virtually unguardable literally i mean it's <laughs> it's just so op you'll see what happens though but i just appreciate y'all so much y'all don't know man uh if we can get like eight likes on this video animations video is coming out the next day so probably sunday yeah sunday but yeah i pulled up with my boy zeke and oh, Mm, I think we were going up against randoms, but you know, superstar one point guard. I was kind of scared. I'm not gonna lie, but we had all randoms on our team. And I was like, all right, this, this probably isn't gonna go well. But this build held its own surprisingly. Um, but yeah, slash and play, lock take. I'll drop that build video if this vid also gets eight like So yeah, man. But I've been having fun with this game a lot. Like I don't think people realize. Yeah, this game is like, it's, it's the bridge to next gen, you feel me? But anyways, you're gonna see the explosion off rip. Like, it's ridiculous how fast this build is. You know, he tried to front run me and look, the space, oh my God. How do you guard that? Like, I don't understand. I've never played against a slashing play that was really good, but this build is insane. You know, he mixed me a little bit right there, but it's cool. You'll see how he bounce back later. But yeah, like the only thing I'd say about this build is spacing can be an issue sometimes. But look at that dime, oh my God. But spacing, yeah, that that's the biggest issue for this build because you gotta have the right team around you. You have to have a stretch or some sort of big man that knows what he's doing and gets out of the paint. You'll see we run into some spacing issues later, but that's expected with randoms anyways. But yeah, it's it's really noticeable on this build. That's all I'm gonna say about that. But um. Look at the explosiveness. I'm already down the court. It's ridiculous. Mm, it's crazy, man. And the defensive ability in this build is ridiculous with the lockdown takeover. I get like an 80 something steal. It's crazy. Good pass from Miranda. Mm. <laughs> it's crazy. But yeah, like, I think I end up with like 40 something. Nah, 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 like 30. But that speed boost glitch right there is unguardable. Like, I don't think people realize how broken that glitch is. But you know, it's in the game, so I'm gonna use it. Uh, that'll definitely be in my dribble tutorial. Let me know if y'all want that in the comments section. I got y'all. And then, you know, my boy Zeke, he ain't got no badges, but oh my God. It's too easy, bro. Like, honestly, when this game first came out, I was shooting like it was 20. But now that I have all my badges and I know my shot, but like, It's, it's <laughs> like once you get all your badges trust me if you're struggling through the shooting grind trust me it gets better with your badges like you just gotta have the right badge loadout the right jump shot with a good visual cue and, and you won't miss really and you have to have a really good three-point rating as well that that's very necessary obviously but look at the defensive ability on this player yeah it's an ai but i don't care like, that's great defense. For a non-defensive build, the pie chart is blue and orange. Blue and yellow, whatever. That pie chart is definitely a sleeper. I think people don't choose it because it can't shoot. But that's not an issue. This build can hit mid-ranges once you get your badges. Trust me. Trust in the process. But I'm telling you, the explosiveness on this build is ridiculous. If you want to have fun on a build and you don't mind having a team that has to adjust around your play style, then this build is for you. It's literally, <laughs> it's literally unguardable. Like, I'm pretty sure I end up with like 30 points and all number twos, all dunks and layups. It's crazy, free throws maybe. 
and the playmaking ability on this build is ridiculous. Like, I could have hit the two guard right there, but I seen that he was going to drag him. That's what I'm talking about. The spacing is great. Like, shout out to my boy Zeke. He has no badges. He's a brave soul for coming in here uh, on the wreck with no badges on the stretch for him. I, I could never go. But yeah, like, I don't know. I don't know why people don't make this build. Shooting is not that big of a necessity at the one, especially if you have, if you're running like maybe mm, three out, two in or even five out, or well, four out, one in with this player. That would be really good. Like the explosiveness on this, on this player is ridiculous. Like you cannot guard this build. It's gonna get to the line and it's gonna freaking score the ball easily. Scoring is not an issue. The only issue with it is the spacing once again. Like as you can see, easy free throws. Free throw rating's like a 80, yeah. And I mean, it's not the greatest build for Rec, I would say. I'd say it's probably really good for uh, Park, but I don't play it. But from what I've seen, most slash, oh my God, like <laughs> the defensive ability on this build is ridiculous. I, I still can't wrap my head around how 2K let this one slide. <laughs> like the, it's athletic, can defend, pass. Look at that, my boy Zeke. It's just so good. And people just don't want to make it just because it can't shoot. Man, if y'all don't just make this build, it's not bad, trust me, trust me. Like it can catch lobs. It can do everything that a play shot can do except for shoot, literally. And you know, my boy Zeke with the takeover. You know, I'm trying to force feed in here low key, but you know, it's cool. But oh my God, look at the explosiveness. Sit down, bro. Like that should have been a contact, but you know, contact dunks go stupid this year. Like they're, I, I don't want to say they're easier than 20, but it, it's, it's pretty close. It's pretty close. It's definitely close. But yeah, you just got to have the right big men around this build. And I'm, I can guarantee you this build will pop off. Like how did my boy Zeke hit that? Oh my God, Diamond. Like, Dimer Hall of Fame, uh, most underrated badge in this game. I don't care what anybody says. But Dimer Hall of Fame, sharp take, no badges. Like, come on, bro. That boy cool. But the ability for this player, like, and this player can play a small court. I'm not going to lie to y'all. If y'all run, like, three point guards. Oh, my God. That drip. But uh, if you run three point guards... You have no problem with this build because it could just run the small board with because of its defensive ability. And you know, if shooting is an issue for you and your teammates don't like that, hey! But if uh, shooting is an issue for you and your teammates don't really, you know, give you the ball, all I'd say is corner camp, wait for a backdoor cut and tell them to throw the lob and this player will go get it and catch it. I'm trying to tell you. I don't have any lob gameplay right now. But look at the ability for this player to drive from the baseline. Like, this build can play, honestly, I want to say the one through three position. Yeah, I'm going to say one through three. Because four is a little bit of a stretch, you know, no pun intended. But it's it's, it's hard. Like, it's if you're not getting, uh, if you're not getting rebounds, you, you're not going to be a big man build. Like, you know, if you don't have the rebounding rating, you're not going to get four but yeah, one through three, this player can play. Um, it's a ridiculous build. Like, look at how quickly I scored 24 and I have nine assists. Like, come on, man. This build is ridiculous. Like, and this speed boost glitch right here, it just makes it 10 times better. I'm trying to tell y'all. But that, that, um, but you can do the glitch with virtually any player. Yeah, I did it on my 7-3 paint piece. Like, it's, it's crazy, bro. But um, I will be doing a dribble tutorial very soon. Uh, so let me know what more do you want from me in the comment section, man? Like uh, I saw last last video's a uh, funny gaming moment, so that'll probably be coming too. But um, yeah, because I, I play a lot of games, but this is definitely my main game. And oh my god, like how do how do you guard that? Somebody in the comment section, tell me how do you guard this build? Yeah, I know somebody's gonna say sag off. No, no. If you sag, 
you're gonna get banged on. I, I don't care. Look at the defensive ability. This player can apply the pressure to anybody. I don't care what anybody says. This build can apply the pressure, even with the lock tape. But yeah, that's all I got for y'all. I ended with 34 points, nine assists, maybe like four turnovers. You know, I was just messing around. Like I seriously was not trying to get 42,000 XP. Like that that's crazy, bro. This really is. Like I get 11,000 XP from this game. But yeah, uh, I appreciate all the support y'all have given me, man. Like it's ridiculous. Just so much love around me. I, I, I don't know what to say, man. But yeah, um, new animation. Animations vid is dropping um, Sunday. If this gets to, oh, what did I say? Eight likes? Yeah, it was eight likes. Yeah, so if this gets to eight likes, animation video is dropping uh, the next day, Sunday. Um, plenty more bangers coming for y'all. But anyways, I'm out of here. Yeah, yeah, I don't wanna go if it's not no pills there. No, no, no. I'm from 1600, no some niggas still there. Yeah. Kicking and kicking on Molly and Zaddy and Perky and Addy.